Okay, in today's video, I'm just gonna show you guys real quick what I've been putting in a Scentsy basket or catalog party. Some people call them parties on the go or uh, show on the goes. There's all kinds of different names for them, but I like to call them a basket party. And I get a lot of questions about these, so here is what I do with them. So these are for hostesses who opt not to have a home party and to take their catalogs and collect orders on their own to earn free and half price products. So this is my basket party. I'll show you what I put in there. Um, first and foremost, I do probably four or five of our catalogs in there. And then I do about 10 to 12 order forms with the door prize slip attached to the top. So, um, I just staple it on there and that's just basically your um, enter your free drawing and give away like a scent circle um, at the end of the month for all my basket parties. And then I do the warmer of the month flyer and because it's the holiday season, I do a couple of the holiday collection brochures and then I just went through, the, we have a couple items that have sold out, so I marked them sold out inside that brochure so nobody orders them. And then I have these little neat um, hostess guides that I had made for myself just on Vistaprint. Um, you can definitely mimic this yourself if you want to. It just has the rewards chart so your hostess understands how that works. Um, tips for having a successful party, calculating orders, um, you know, payment information. And then on the back, I just talk about um, how there's combine and save bundles and things like that. So that's just my personal little sheet. Um, you could definitely make your own with your own information. And then inside the basket, I always do a bar of the scent of the month along with um, I write try me on the outside with a Sharpie so that they know that they can try it if they have a warmer at home or in their office at work, wherever they might be bringing their basket, I encourage them to try out the scent of the month. I always have a transition set of testers. So the testers that are in the bottom of that basket are the current fall winter transition tester set. Um, I don't put a full set in there, uh, mostly for space reasons and for affordability. It's just easier to have sets of the transition testers. And then with the new catalog, I'm actually including one of our new wall fan diffusers in here and telling the hostess to try it out, um, whether she's at work or at home and give it a go. So um, I have this in here. It's a really good way to showcase this product, which happens to be one of my favorites. Um, I have pods, two pods inside there, Go Go Mango, but it does not matter what scent you happen to put in there. That's just what I had in there for now. And then a pen. So that is, lit oh, and a scent circle, just as a reminder to people and to just kind of jazz it up and make it look cute. So uh, that's my basket party right now. I will be dropping it off to her tomorrow. Now remember, the most important part of doing a basket party is uh, hostess coaching and making sure she understands what her expectations and her goals are for her party so that she can earn free and half price product. Uh, one thing I failed to mention, I buy these uh, six by nine, I believe, envelopes. Everything's sticking together because I only have one hand. But um, I do buy these manila envelopes on Amazon. I put the hostess's name in the event that it's like sitting somewhere, someone knows whose party it is. Um, orders and payment go in here, tax is this, shipping is this, unless it hits 500. And if you have any questions, they can call or text me. So that is just something. And then she just puts her orders and her money right inside this envelope. So that's it. Gonna run. Uh, if you have any questions, just comment below.